I was uh, working the other day. I made a bigger furnace, and I wanted to see if I could get more heat from the propane I was burning. So I went ahead and spent the sixty-nine dollars and bought a pint of the ceramic coating that you would coat fire bricks with, which is supposed to increase the efficiency of the furnace and so you'd have less costs. Well, I guess. <laughs> I didn't notice any difference, but I don't have any means to scientifically test. But what I did notice was that if I took a plain old graphite crucible and coated it with it, this is one I did yesterday. Uh, it greatly extends the life of the graphite. Uh, this was a crucible. It was a little R9 uh, electro furnace crucible. And I, I used it in the micro mini furnace to the point that it was just about totally eaten away. But so I went ahead and just coated it with the coating and I'll probably be able to get eight ten more melts out of this so, so I was just playing with it but it's a pretty simple process I take well let me get down onto the, the furnace the flame there I'm just using a little uh, light little flame on a torch and a vise and all I do is just give it the slightest amount of preheat uh, like so and then I just take the mixture and start applying it not really very scientific here pretty simple process to do. Uh, this is I don't ever leave anything alone so this is a mixture of different coatings. But anyway just simply put it on like that and now I gotta get rid of where my crucible was and or my tongs and get that last little bit done and it's uh going to take this thing and using it in a torch environment it's going to extend its life out to where you'll get uh quite a few more pours out of it i can take this one little crucible that was almost eaten away. I've got two coats on it now. I get a third coat on it and it's just about back up to its original diameter. I don't know if you could do this uh, if you were going to put this back in an R9 uh, because I think the diameter would get a little too big and then just all this does is flashes the water out of it that I, I mixed it with and uh, they work out pretty good uh, they glow up um, transfer the heat possibly maybe takes 10 percent longer well the thicker you get it the, the longer it's going to take to melt but anyway 
that's just a ceramic mixture of ceramic coatings. Uh, it's probably about 10% of the ICT 100 HT. And then I believe the other one I used was the ITC 215. It, it's a ceramic coating for metal parts inside of kilns and furnaces. But uh, at the cost of graphite, this is a, a pretty good little venture there. Anyway, that's just a, a tip on how to get more life out of your graphite. Do a quick little correction there. That was uh, ITC 213 was the steel coating for the the kilns. I thought it was 250. It's 213, uh, and I mix the two together. So it turned out pretty good. I'm gonna try a couple other ingredients too here pretty quick. Anyway, I stand corrected.